Hello and welcome back to my another tutorial. In this tutorial, I am going to share with you how to fix Windows 11 start menu not working. Also, Windows 11 search bar is not working. So, let's take a look how to do that. Maybe somehow or some cases your Windows 11 start menu and search bar is not working in this video i'm going to share you two different couple of way how you can fix that first of all i will suggest you to restart windows explorer in order to do that you need to click in your keyboard ctrl alt delete whenever you click ctrl alt delete you can see your lucky skin is going to be looks like this you need to click here tax manager so actually in my system i search bar and tax manager this start menu is working but uh, i will jump over the tax manager so i'm going to just right click over on it and then i'm going to click here tax manager so after open the tax manager whenever you press ctrl or delete and you will go from jump over from lock skin to tax manager and it's going to be looks like this so here you need to click this more details and it's going to be uh, looks like this is go all the way down and try to find out Windows Explorer. After choose this Windows Explorer you need to click here restart and after that see is your Windows 11 start menu and search bar is working or not. If it is not working let me share with you the second step. Same things you need to click in your keyboard Ctrl Alt Delete and then whenever you click Ctrl Alt Delete it's going to be looks like this. You need to click choose the tax manager so when you click tax manager it's going to be looks like this. From here you need to click these services. After click over services you need to find out W search. So this is the uh, W search. This is the you can see. I'm just trying to find out w search so this is the w search so right click over on it and click here open services after click over open services is going to be looks like this you need to scroll all the way down and then you need to find here again windows search so this is the windows search double click over on it and then you're going to see it's going to be looks like this you need to choose a startup type automatic and first of all you need to click here stop and it's going to be stopped and again click here start and click here apply and click here ok and after that restart your pc and then after restart your pc and then try to open your windows 11 start menu and search bar hopefully it's going to be work in this step we're going to disable recommended and recent open apps Sometimes if you turn on this recommended and recent open apps, it's make delay to open a start menu and search bar. For example, if I jump for a start menu, you can see this is the uh, recommended apps and uh, also it's going to be appear as however it's appear the recent apps. So we're going to disable this thing. So in order to do that, you need to go in your Windows 11 start menu and then click here setting. After click over setting, you can see skin appear just like this. You need to click here personalization. After click over personalization, you need to click here start, and then you can see something says show recent added apps. I'm going to turn this off. Also, something says show recent open items in start jump list and file explorer. We're going to turn this off. Hopefully, within this step, also it's going to fix your Windows 11 start menu and search bar. If it is not working, let me share it to the third step. In this step, we're going to open our control panel and then you're going to see our control panel going to be looks like this. We're going to click here troubleshooting. After click over troubleshooting, we're going to click here view all and we're going to see it's going to be looks like this. We're going to click here search and indexing. After click over search and indexing, we're going to click here next. And then you're going to see there is a, a lot of options appear. First of all, we're going to choose this scan start a search or see result. We're going to choose that and then we're going to click here next. And it's going to be uh, fixing uh, if there is any issue with our search bar or start menu. 
after that you can close your pc and restart your pc and then see is it working or not hopefully after in this step it might be going to be work if it is not work in we're going to share it to the fourth step in this step we're going to type a, a code in our powershell so first of all we're going to open our a run command by pressing win key plus r and then we're going to see it's going to have a run command here we're going to type p o w e r s h e w -L, l and hit enter we're going to see windows powershell going to be run here we're going to type a code this code you're going to find in my video description just simply copy and paste it over here and after that hit enter after run this code successfully restart your pc and then see this code your windows 11 start menu and search bar going to be work if it is not work uh, let me share it to the five step which is we're going to try to update our pc so in this case we need to jump over in our windows 11 start menu and then we're going to click here setting after click our setting we're going to click here on this update and then we're going to click here check for update and see if there is an update available or not if it's available then download the update and then try to after finishing the update and try to restart your pc and then see is the windows 11 start menu and search bar is working or not hopefully in this way it might be what if it does not work in this time we're going to share it to the step number six in this time we're going to uh, edit with our registry editor before jump over register editor, I will suggest you if uh, uh, register editor is something very complicated and if you make some mistake, it might be damage your windows. So be before that, be sure and you want to uh, do or do some changes. Before that, I will suggest you to take a backup your register editor. Anyway, we're going to open our register editor by pressing one key plus R and it's going to be appear this run command. Here you're going to type here R E G E D I T D I T and hit enter and you're going to see our register editor going to be appear. After open the register editor, it's going to be looks like this. We're going to extend our H key local machine and after extend H key local machine, we're going to extend the system folder. After extend the system folder, we're going to click extend the current control set after click over current control set we're going to click here services after extend the services we need to find here wp user services which is uh, need to go scroll all the way down uh, in this section and then try to find out wp user services you can see this is the wp and user services after choose that in the right side you can see some code is available here you're going to find something say start by b b default value is 2 we're going to make it 4 and then we're going to click here ok and then we're going to restart our pc after restart your pc hopefully within this step your windows 11 i start menu and search bar going to be work if it is not work let me share it to the last step which is we're going to again press one key plus r and in this time we're going to type here cmd and hit enter after type cmd and hit enter you're going to see it's can appear just like this when you type here s f c space first less is scan now so you type is scan now and then hit enter it's going to be take some time for doing this scan after done successfully then restart your pc and after all restart your pc hopefully windows 11 start menu and search bar going to be work so it is all this step i just try to share with you guys hopefully one of them might be working for you if it is work definitely don't forget to write something in the comment section which uh, uh, was helpful for you so that's for now Thanks for watching my video. See you next one. Peace.